All right, so I took this guided tour in our city to look at statues、uh, to learn more how they supposedly told something about the historical moments in our society. The tour was called、uh, Rocky Buttocks. Yes, it showed buttocks,、uh, but it was also supposed to show what kind of cultural disputes and thoughts the statues raised at the particular moments in time. So, these statues were done approximately 100 years ago. We were told that the statues were representing or provoking rise of new sense of nationalism and birth of independence. Promiscuous thoughts. How public servants wanted Helsinki to look more like a metropolis, showing the steps of neoclassism, showing the two different sides of human mind. The idea that mermaids just can't help themselves for their nature, and that all their impulsiveness and sentimentality were forgiven. Mermaids, right? And this one was hunting goddess.、Uh, not sure what that means then or now. And that this statue symbolized work and cooperation in a society that is heading towards modern times. But what struck me were other kinds of points of views, like、uh, posing in a more secure way that felt more feminine. I don't know. Maybe that was more like our view from the present time, looking to the past.、Uh, that the statue supposedly destroyed everything that was done for women at the time.、Um, a naked women symbolized, or are allegories, or something.、Uh, allegories.、Uh, anyway. What really hit me was that nobody, and I mean nobody, was looking or barely noticing these statues. And supposedly there are like 500 of these statues or similar works of art in Helsinki region alone. I mean, just like me, we all probably have seen many of them in our cities, but do we really care about these statues? I guess I wanted to see some deeper meaning behind these statues, like、uh, something that tells things about our society, something more philosophical or spiritual, something that would give me the feeling of empowerment or something. Definitely something more. But the reality is that. This one haven't even had the water fountain working anymore for a long time. It made me feel sad. And this one, we couldn't even see it up close. Only behind iron frame. And then even the security card came to check what we were doing because supposedly we had triggered an alarm already by getting too close. And this one, I couldn't also see due to renovation. And there is a plan now to put an iron cage to protect it from us, because we have been destroying it by climbing on it for years. What does that tell about us? Now that I think about these observations of moments in our history through these statues, and how people might be thinking in another hundred years from now about our society through these or similar statues, all I can say is that right now, at this very moment, gosh, I feel depressed. <laughs> <laughs>